Hey team, welcome to today's strength and conditioning class. Uh, you're here on my honeymoon, so welcome. Um, we're in the mail dives today uh, with Kane. Um, so strength and conditioning today, it's going to be the first half is strength, some strength work. Second half, we're going to get the heart rate up and see what we can do. Uh, so if you do have some weights, please grab them because we will need them today. I'm going to use my dumbbells. Um, you can use whatever you've got, even cookbooks, um, some minestrone or some leftover pumpkin soup will work. Um, if you are injured or pregnant, make sure you've got clearance to do some workouts today, um, just to be safe. Um, and we'll start a walk very soon. We've got some rock music today, so hopefully that gets you through as well. Uh, so to start with our warm-up, we're going to go just two minutes. My favourites, we always start here. So I'm going to start tall, we're going to go down to my toes, walk yourself into a push-up position, add the push-up, and then come back up again. Make sure you've got your cords in control. All right, down we go. Walk yourself out into a push-up. And we're gonna do four of these. Ooh. Add one more, come back up. I'm gonna add you, I'm gonna catch you on the last one. Okay, hey Kerry, good to see you again. So down we go, into a push-up. Add one, and we stay here. So left foot comes to the left hand. Yeah, keep the back leg nice and straight. Feel that stretch through the hip. We're going to start some lower body work to start with. So let's get ready to go. Let's change. So back to push-up position. Right foot to right hand. Up we come. Yeah, and stay here. Just work into the stretch. All right, we're going to do a bit of yoga. So back to push-up position. Push your hips to the roof. Yeah, come back. Left foot to left hand. This time we're going to add a rotation. So we're going to go up to the roof. Up we go. So feel that stretch on the outside of the hip. Yeah. Get it ready to go. Back to push up. Hips to the roof. Downward dog this one. Right foot to right hand. Up we go. Up to the roof. Take a look at your backdrop. Alright. One more time. Let's go up. Stand tall. Alright. I'm going to talk you through the first two movements that we have. Okay. Go your dumbbells. First one we've done before. So we're going to stand nice and tall. Take a big step backwards onto a back toe. Drop the back knee to the floor. And come back up. Change legs. Other leg goes back. Drop the knee. And come up. Now we're just doing six on each to make 12 of those lunges. Okay. Every 40 seconds. The second move, we're going to combine two. So plant one foot. Push our hips back to here. And then we add a row. Yeah. Come back in, change legs. Yeah, there are two moves. All right, so let's go to number one. Weights can be here or by your side, so let's step back. We're just doing six on each. If you want to, add that little pulse at the bottom. Add that intensity. All right, let's get through this first one. So we're changing exercises every 40 seconds. Yeah? Add that pulse. Make sure the step is nice and big. Up we go. And I want to get one more here. One more. Let's come up. So you can stay with two feet on the floor if you want to. Push your hips back as an option. Otherwise, we're on one foot. Plant it. Hips go back. Hands to our knees. Then elbows to the roof. Change legs each time. Yeah, find that happy place here. And row. Yeah. Each time. Let's get one more. And we go back to the start. Up we go. Knee to the floor, that's important. Good morning, Marissa, good to see you again. You're here, are you doing the work? Hey, you had a big birthday on the weekend. Let's work it off. Up we go. All done. Very quick, just one more. So we're going to keep moving this time. Plant the leg, go to your position. And go one and two. Yeah, two at a time. Hips go back, eyes to the floor. One, two. Yeah, challenge your balance. All those stabilizing muscles. Let them do some work. Keep working through. Give that chest to the floor. Tilt. Up we come. 
two at a time. Stay with it. Now we're going three rounds. So we're nearly there. Let's get through this one. Another ten. So let's do one, two, one more on the other leg. Down we go. Nice and stable. Up we come. Back to, back to the front. I wonder how many Mars bars Marissa had on the weekend. They're her favourite. All right, so we go back to our lunge. One more time here. Take a big step. Let's drop. Pulse. Come back up. Yeah. Well done. With that front foot, make sure we've got the whole foot on the floor, okay? We don't want that knee to fall in or out. Add the pulse. Up we come. Nice and tall with that chest. Yeah. Lock in the tummy, stay tall, drive to the front heel. All those stabilizing muscles now, starting to burn. That's what we're after. Well done. Now we come, a little rest. One more, yeah? So it's a crane position, otherwise you're just here, yeah? All right, let's go. One leg at a time. Wobbling's okay, but I don't want you to move if you're wobbling. Yeah, get stable. One, two, up we come. This is round three, let's do three. Yeah, one, two, three. Woo. Those stabilizers are starting to fire. One, two, three, really important here. We don't round the back, okay? Keep that weight in our glutes. Yeah, back we go. One, two, three this time, good. Now with your back toe, I want that to be facing the floor. Yeah, we don't want to be opening up like this, okay? That's no good. Back to the first leg. Hey, Naomi, good to see you. One, two, this is three. Up we come, and again. Up, have your rest. Take a moment, we're going to change our exercises. We're going to keep that weight just for the one, okay? This time, number one, we're going sumo squats. Going wide, yeah, toes are pointed out. Weights can be here. The muscle tool, you want your elbows underneath your weights. We're going to drop, just like a squat, and press out, yeah? We're really targeting the adductors in a different way, but it's like glutes to do a lot of the work, yeah? They do the heavy lifting, and then we do push-ups after that, yeah? Ones we've all done before. So I want you to go nice and wide with that feet, outside shoulder, toes are pointed out, weights in, we're gonna go, three, two, one, we're here for 40 seconds. If you want to, add that pulse. As we did before, to add intensity, add the pulse. Yeah, down we go, drive out. Two, good. Two. Add the pulse. We want to get that burn, yeah? We should be feeling that in our glutes after all this. 20 seconds. This is our strength component, yeah? We don't need to move fast. Slow and controlled. It's going to get the benefit we were after. Up we go. We've got five seconds. We'll get one more. Up. Weights can go down into our push-ups. Now we've got 40 seconds, as many as you can do. Making sure our hips are long or straight. If we're here, here, or even here, you can come closer. That's your option. Start here. So that's too easy. Knees go back to there. If that is too easy, hips up to here. And if you still want a challenge, we're going to add that pulse. So we're down. And up, yeah? That time under tension is what we're after doing our strength training. 40 seconds. Good job. This is exactly the exercise I'll be doing on my honeymoon. One more. Nice, up we come, have that little rest. Find your weights. 
up nice and tall. Back to our sumos. We've got two rounds. That's it. Yeah, get through our strength training. And then we're going to get the heart rate up. So come up nice and tall. Feet wide. Toes out. And drop. Yeah, down we go. Press. As always, the option at that little pulse. Now with strength training, the benefits come hours afterwards, yeah? But all they're getting the heart rate up, the instant feedback. Your body takes hours to recover. That's where the benefits are. Up we go. At the pulse. Stay there. Nice and low. 10 seconds. Well done, keep those knees wide. One more. Up. Take your 15. We go to push ups. Only got three efforts to go, yeah? Inside three minutes. Get to our strength training. Let's get into the hit. Yeah? So push up position. Start on your toes if you went before. Challenge yourself. Down. Pulse. Up. Yeah? It's not about speed. That control. Let's get that breathing right. On the effort, we breathe out, yeah? Every time, breathe out on the press. Well done. Feel the burn. Inside 10. Let's get another one. Come on. Up, slow. One. A little extra. Oh, one more to go. 40 seconds. Gotta be careful, we might get sunburned here in the null dives. All right, with our squats, feet are wide. Grab the floor, actively grab the floor with your toes. Weights come up, let's drop, pulse. Yeah, nice and wide with our knees. Slip, slop, slap, what has been told. Up we go. Let's go, another 20. Another 20. This is our last one on our legs. Let's keep that depth. Get to that knee, cross, knee line and back up. Pulse. One more. Come on. They're done. Let's push that floor away. All right, five seconds. Let's finish our strength training. We're on the beach in the Meldives, remember? Here we go. At the pulse. The longer you spend down the bottom, the more benefit you will get. That's your challenge. Even if you're here, at the pulse. Yeah, it's the time under tension that we're after. Up we go. Good, locking that tummy now. Last ones. 15. Grab that floor and push. On that breath every time. Down, up. Let's get one more. Pulse, up, rest. Ah, grab your weight. This time you only need one. It's gonna start in between your feet. If you don't have a weight, that's okay. We can make it work. We're gonna go three movements, three movements for three minutes, yeah? So, if you've got a weight, you're here. Back to your squat position. What we're gonna do is go down and grab that weight, yeah? But we don't wanna be here. Drop your hips so you can use the power on the floor. Drive the floor away. Get it above your head in one movement, yeah? We're not going to the shoulder and pressing. We're going from the floor to the roof. And then we change the other side. If you don't, if you don't have a weight, let's go without, let's just touch the floor, go up to the roof, yeah? Our power jack, we've done that before. If you do have a weight, grab that. We've done snatches, yeah? We'll then go plyo lunge, just like at the warm up. Plyo lunges, yeah? Last movement, use the weight again if you have it. If not, go without, we go side to side, yeah? There your movements. Fly a lunge, you can always make it just a step back. Just be here and just go within your range, yeah? 
You don't need, don't need to go knee to floor every time. All right, set yourself up. Make sure you got room. All your pets are out the way, you're not gonna kick them. Yeah, maybe some wildlife, a monkey or something. All right, we're gonna go in 10. We've got three minutes of work. So with three minutes, we're doing as many rounds as possible. So you don't have to stay with me. You can go ahead if you want to, see if you can beat me. So we're gonna start with snatches, five on each side, yeah? All right, three, two, one. From the floor to the roof and change. Yeah, that change can be here. It can be at the bottom. Yeah, pushing the floor away as we go. Well done. As many as you can. I have one job to count and I forgot. I'm doing one more. To the side. It's our plyo lunges. So step back. Drop. Drive out. For 16, so eight on each leg. That's good. Keep going, I'm halfway. At your own pace. Or you're with me, or you're ahead of me. Hey, Kerry. Yeah. Careful all your dogs you've got at home. Well done. Russian twist, side to side. And we don't need to go to the floor. We can go away from the body, further and further, yeah? Feet up, feet on the floor. Options, yeah? Reduce the range before we come up as far as you can, yeah. We're here for 20, which means 10 on each side. Out we go. Guess what, forgot to count again. Here we go. Four, three, two, one. Back to the top. Five and five, yeah, let's go. Up. This is where you challenge yourself get as many as you can. This is where we want the heart rate to climb. Up we go. Get through this one. Up. Drive the floor. Reach the roof. Well done. Apply your lunges. Eight on each. Let's go. So step back. Drive. Your option. Step. Drop. Step, oh, keep the balance, yeah? Control that front leg, let's go. And change. Feel the burn, yeah, we've done enough. Keep moving. I'm gonna go, three, two, one. Down to the floor. Go feet up. Over. 20. Halfway, come with me. Nine, 20, here we go. Let's keep moving, yeah? We're nearly there. We've only got 15 seconds. We get a minute rest. Up we go, get your snatches done. Push the floor. Three, stay here. And time, rest and relax. Oh, well done, one down, one to go. We've got one minute of rest. On to our last ones. So, last one, we use our weights. A little bit of strength, so we're back to our squats, yeah? If we, if not, that's if we haven't done enough. Normal squat then. Hip shoulder width, toes slightly out, grab the floor. Up to our chest, and we're here. Yeah, we're doing 10, 10 squats. We're gonna get straight into a plank. If you've got weights, we're gonna use that. So, side plank, shoulder over elbow, hip up, and then from here we go bang to the roof. Yeah, hips are nice and still. Five on this side, five on the other, yeah? Then we're gonna run it back. We're gonna be here, soft sorted. If you can, up we go to a hollow hold, and we rock. Up onto your hip, yeah, with 10 of these. If not, to tabletop, hips and shoulders off. Let's go, opposite arm, opposite leg. 
out to a dead bug and change. Again, five on each side to make ten. Yeah? Alright. We're gonna go. Three, two, one with our squats. Ten. Yeah, if you don't have weights, they can go. We can do a plyo. Yeah? Up you go. Up to you. We're doing just ten. And then we go straight to our plank. One more. Alright, to our plank. Choose one side. Feet together. You can go to one knee as well as an option. Otherwise you're here with me. Hip goes up. Dumbbell to the roof. Drive out, yeah? So locking that tummy. So we're not doing this, yeah? Hips are still. One more. Little break dancing to the other side. From the floor. Up, hips are still. Locking the tummy. One more. Well done. On to the back. You can come with me. Do your hollow. Up. Rock to your hip. Now hold that position. Use your core control to get back up to the hip. Yeah, nice and still. Three. Two. One more. Up. Squats. Find your weights. Ten. Just ten, yeah? We're halfway. Stay tall with that chest. Hips to the knee line. And up. Yeah. Two more. Down we go to the floor. Side plank. Feet together. Hips go up. Drop. Five on this side. In control. One more. Up. Switch. Rocking the time, your hips are still. Drive out. One minute to go. Last one. Come on. You're in the Mel dives. Let's do it. To a hollow rock or a dead bug, yeah? You can look like this. Two. Three. As long as that belly button's on the floor, has to be, yeah? Let's go to the last ones. Up. On control, come on. Two more. Up. Last one. All right, to your feet. Let's get one more round. Go about 30 seconds. Come on. This is where you challenge yourself. Grit your teeth. Get through. One more. I'm doing a full round. Come with me. Yeah, we get a cool down after this. Feet together, hips go up. Up we go. Three, two, one more. Up we go. We're rocking out today. To finish, five to go. To the roof. Hips are still. Yeah. Control your movement. Extra. Last one. Dead bugs, hollow rocks. Whatever you've got left, yeah. Up we come, hips and shoulders up, go as long as possible, rock, we've got 10, hold your position, can't go fast here, five to go, three, two, one, up we come, oh, let's take some time now, yeah, let that heart rate come back down, this is also my favourite cool down. Knees go wide. We push back to our hips, reach forward. Let's take all that pressure out of the lower back. Look at the floor. Oh. So we've done a bit of both today. We've done some strength training. The body's going to take hours to recover from that. It's nearly barely carries until, until dinner time. It means a hard event. And the hip training's just got to heart rate up. We're going to cover that's your training. All right, we're going to do one more where we go. On all fours, reach as far as you can. A bit of rotation. Should feel nice and good. Oh, one more on the other side. 
And I think I might go for a quick dip in the ocean behind me to call off. Maybe jump in your bath at home. But thanks for joining me today. Thanks for joining there, Marissa. That's worth a few, maybe half a Mars bar, I reckon. We've got a few more workouts to catch up on. But guys, until tomorrow, I'll be with you tomorrow for a core workout as well. Until then, look after yourself. Make sure you eat something, drink something after that. Uh, this nutritious, of course. And I'll see you next time. Thank you.